Hey guys, my name is Trey from Chevrolet Buick GMC of Puyallup. Today I'll be going over the all new 2024 Buick Invista ST. All right, starting off with the exterior, you're gonna have your Moonstone gray metallic. Um, I love how this color looks on the black 19s with the black mirror caps and the black molding on the bottom. Moving around to the front, you have your grill that is standard on the ST. You can see that you have your ST badging right there, which gives it that sporty look, um, hence the name Sport Touring. Moving around to the side, you are going to see that you have a sunroof, which is pretty common on the ST. Not a standard feature, but definitely a feature that you would love to have out here in the PNW of Washington. Moving on to the back, you're going to have your hatchback, kind of stylish look. Um, I honestly love that it's on an SUV, gives you plenty of space, and kind of gives it that nice sleek look along with the front. All right, moving on into the interior, you're going to have your hatchback, just like I mentioned before. Plenty of space, you got about 42 cubic feet of space in here. Plenty of space for camping gear, strollers, or even a grocery run. You got cubbies on both sides, and you also have a little bit of storage where your spare is. Walking around to this way, we can go a little bit deeper into some of the safety features and the mechanical aspects of the vehicle. You are going to have your 1.2 liter Ecotec turbo engine. Um, I honestly love how fuel efficient this engine is. You get about 28 in the city and 32 in the highway, which is pretty unreal in an SUV. I remember back then riding in a big old V8 SUV and only getting about 10 miles per gallon, which is not what you want nowadays. So now we got the Invista for you. Moving on to some of the safety features for you. You got blind spot monitors, forward collision alert, pedestrian braking, all of those nice things along with your parking sensors as well. All right guys, moving on into the interior. Um, you're gonna have a lot of convenience features, a lot of updates and a lot of nice things in this new model. Um, first thing starting out, as you can see, you got your new Buick logo right there and the ST badging that they started adding to the headrest only on the Sport Touring model. And then you got your black leather with the optional blue stitching. Um, I honestly love all the new designs that they've made with this, with this new car. Um, I've been thinking about getting one myself. Um, convenience features, um, you're going to have your heated seats, heated steering wheel, and you're going to have your remote start, which works hand-to-hand -hand with that heated seats and that heated steering wheel. Those early mornings, 6, six o'clock in the morning, when you don't want to get into a cold car, remote start your car and it'll warm it up for you. Moving on to some of the safety features that I mentioned before, they're all controlled from in here. Your lane keep assist, um, which intertwines with your blind spot monitors. You're gonna have your forward collision alert button, so that way you can set it between one car length, two car lengths, and three car lengths. And you're gonna have your Intella high beams, so that way when you're driving dark, down a dark road, you want your high beams on, but you don't wanna have to keep turning them off and on. They will turn off automatically when it, when it detects a light or a car coming at you. All right guys, moving up to the 11 inch display. You're gonna see a lot of nice things up here. No buttons for the main screen, but they moved it all over to your entertainment system. Um, you're gonna have your maintenance, your maintenance updates, like your tire pressure, your oil life. You got some nice gauges for your battery voltage and your coolant temperature. And then you have your trip button, so that way you can see how much gas you're saving driving our new Invista. Um, let's see how it test drives. All right guys, so starting off with the test drive portion of the video, I wanted to talk about some of the some of the safety features and convenience features that we have in here. Um, I'm honestly loving how it's super quiet. As you can tell, we are recording in a vehicle and you don't hear that much road noise. Um, I love the noise cancellation that Buick focuses on in their doors, along with some of the lane keep assist features, the forward collision alert features, um, like the car in front of me, if I'm coming up on it a little too fast, I will get a little red light reflected onto the windshield a lot, along with some chime noises as well. So looking at some of the, looking at my surroundings, um, I don't have really any blind spots in here. Um, hence you have the blind spot monitors as well, but you have a pretty good vision of space. So moving from the, from the red light, I'm hitting a couple of bumps. Um, I'm loving how this vehicle is, is absorbing all the potholes and all that different type of stuff. Kind of gives me that smooth ride. I feel comfortable. My seat is su super comfortable. Um, I don't have any complaints. So one thing that I'm gonna that I love about about this vehicle and with the road conditions that we have, 
um, with those bumpy roads, traffic, constant lights. Um, you're sitting pretty comfortably. I, I feel like I'm sitting on a recliner. All right, guys, so now that I'm getting on the freeway, I am approaching some traffic. Um, let's say that you are distracted for any reason. Um, like I mentioned before, you do have that forward collision alert. I'm kind of just gliding along the freeway, moving with traffic, and I feel super, super comfortable. The braking is super smooth. Um, even if I have to step on it and get a little bit, little bit of pet, no worries, you do have that 1.2 liter turbo in here as well. So I wanted to show you guys some, some of the features and how they work. Down here, you are going to have your lane keep assist. When that little orange light is on, your lane keep, assi lane keep assist is on. And there you go, you have your auto stop start. So let's say you're, you're on a long drive, you approach a light, it will cut down the engine to save you a little bit of gas. Um, but if you're on stop and go traffic, you don't have to worry about the engine cutting off and on again. Moving on to the steering wheel, you're gonna have your heated steering wheel button. Just like the lane keep assist, when that little orange button is on, you are good to go. You're gonna have a nice toasty steering wheel. And right above that, you're gonna have your forward collision alert button. So that way you can set it between one car length, two car lengths, and three car lengths. And then your standard cruise control buttons. So you are gonna have adaptive cruise control, which I honestly love to use in stop and go traffic. When a car slows down, it'll slow you down. Um, when that car speeds up, it will speed you up as well. And it does work hand in hand with the lane keep assist and your blind spot monitors as well. I wanted to say thank you to our friends here at Five RV Center for letting us film our brand new Buick and Vista at their location. If you're looking for a motorhome, RV, or a trailer, come down here and visit my friends. If you're looking for an RV to tow, flat tow your Buick and Vista, come down here and check out the Ventana. All right, guys, just finished up with the test drive. I was honestly impressed with this vehicle. Um, there are three things that come to mind when I think of the Buick and Vista, which is practicability, efficiency, and luxury. My name is Trey at Chevrolet Puyallup. Come see me if you want to put yourself in a brand new Invista. Don't forget to like and subscribe.